Hello everyone, today I'm going to talk about congenital lobar oval patient imaging. Definition, congenital lobar oval inflation, CLO, previously called congenital lobar emphysema. It is hyperinflation of one or I call one lung lobe due to partial obstruction of bronchus. Abnormal bronchus acts as one wave lung leading to fluid draping prenatally and air draping postnatally. More common sign and symptom prenatal incidental echogenic lung lesion on screening ultrasound, respiratory distress in near neonatal period, and may be progressive. Other sign and symptom asymmetry of movement of chest with respiratory rate, respiration, use of accessory muscle of respiration, Decrease breath sound on affected sides, hyper resonant amygdala. Demography may be diagnosis in utero of those developing symptoms, majority occur as neonate or infant, may be present with symptom later in childhood or may be incidental finding. Predominantly happen or affected male. This makes more common in white person. Etiology unknown in crop. Instrinsic or external bronchial obstruction. Only alveolar lobe increase number of raja alveolar alveoli. Associated abnormality, cardiac abnormality in up to 20%, transient bronchial obstruction during canalicular phase of lung development. Top difference analysis. Microcytic CPAM. By, by diagnostic clue, homogeneously echogenic lung mass without cystic or systemic arterial blood supply. Location Lung upper lobe. On left upper lobe, predominant than the right middle lobe, and predominant than the right upper lobe. And more predominantly than left lobe lobe or one lobe. Morphology could be segment of or lobe bar distribution. In radiograph, Classic newborn appearance, fluid field, radio plate pulmonary segment or low become progressively hyperlucency or hyperexpanding. Classic appearance in unknown, usually detected as gas field hyperexpansion low beyond immediately newborn period. Pulmonary vessel may be appear attenuated or an evenly splay. Mass effect, compression of epsilateral lung, mediastinosis with possible tracheal deviation or compression of contralateral lung, deviation of anterior chancel line, occasional rib separation, and hemidiaphragm depression, persistent hyperinflation of low segment despite epsilateral decubitus.
New bond larger graphs show a large, expansive, lengthy, warm, opacity peripherally. This is an example of CLO appear uniformly then because it still contain retained fetal fluid. AP radiograph obtained one in, uh, in the first few hours of light demonstrate segment of aspect opacity of the right middle lobe. The opacity reflect retained fetal fluid, fluid field Hourly in affecting segment. Pull up a radiograph of the same patient the next day so that the same segment is now gas filled, quite loosened, and hyper expanded. Mm -hmm. AP radiograph so subtle is symmetric, loosened. C and hyper expansion of left upper lobe that went unnoticed on initial imaging. Note the malposition umbilical venous catheter in the right atrium. AP radiograph in the same patient nine months later when he presented with worsening respiratory stress, so progressive hyperexpansion and loosen in the left upper lobe, the resulting mass effect caused shift of the head toward the right mm -hmm. with compressive atelectasis. Postnatal radiograph in a nine-day-old male infant with respiratory stress so hyperlucency, hyperexpanded left upper lobe with mass effect of the heart, myasthenium, and left lobe lobe. This is the case of congenital lobar hyper lobar overinflation. The left upper lobe of the lung is hyper expanded with mediastinal shift toward the right, a portion of the left lung. Mm -hmm. is henated across the midline. NCT finding non contrast enhanced CT, hyperinflation with uniform hyperlucency of affected lung parenchyma, no discrete cyst. Contrast enhanced CT. IV contrast is used to evaluate the vascular structure and add in detecting other abnormality like sequestration, congenital pulmonary airway malformation, bronchogenic cyst. Alternated vessels smaller and more widely sparse than space than those in adjacent lung. Chest CT in, this, in a patient so similar finding as radiograph include hyperlucency expanded left upper lobe, left upper lobectomy was performed, confirmed CLO. This is a case CT of low bioinflation, so hyperinflation and poor vascularization of left upper lobe with contralateral mediastinal to the right. Attenuated low bar bronchi to the left upper lobe, subsequent mass effect in the form of vaginal displacement to the right side, finding a matching with congenital lobar overinflation of the left upper lobe. Photosound finding prenatal uniformly hyperechoic lung mass without macrocysts or systemic atrial 
supply. What's not useful if a painted line is still fluid filled, then we can find homogeneous and similar to the liver. 24 week ultrasound of the feta chest so homogeneously ecogenic like Apollo lesion, no macrosis or systemic feeding arterial were identified within the mass. Longitudinal ultrasound in a patient so that fluid field CALO is hyper echoic but otherwise has not more lung architecture, giving it an appearance similar to the liver on this image. MRI Fetal MRI homogeneous T2 bright pulmonary mass without architectural distortion or discrepancies pulmonary vessel in in both segment may appear elongated, maybe you may see adjacent T2 bright tubular branching structure. Mass effect with compression of epsilateral remaining lungs and just elevation of the lesion is helpful, but mass effect can make localizing lesion difficult. High drop is less common compared to CPAN. Gaining interest, particularly with other sound, other short T, E, sequences for lung parenchyma. 29 make fatal, weak fatal MI in a patient so uniformly T2 hyperintense lesion mm. occupying the left upper lobe. In the case of congenital low back overinflation, a red arrow indicated for expanded hyper intense high right upper lobe, blue arrow indicated for compressed hypo intense array low lobe, and probably the middle lobe. Treatment consider bronchoscopy to exclude endobronchial lesion, especially if presenting beyond newborn period. Mitigate the respiratory distress caused by mass effect. Thoracoscopic lobectomy conservative treatment has been advocated for patients with minimal symptom. Take home message. Typical diagnosis by serial chest radiograph. Contrast enhanced CT is performed to confirm diagnosis, is elucidate potential cause and exclude other lung malformation. Thank you.